Vlog. We're with Jay again. Today we're in another another mall called Lojas, um, out east of Kowloon. And there's some pretty cute stuff here. Look at this. Very Japanese style. Some yummy drinks. It's called the Lojas Collection. How cute are you? Why? Mmm, so cute. <laughs> Such a big development. It's monolithic. Oh, you huge. Wow. That's First time? It looks like there's a huge bridge over there. Ooh. Like central or something. Well, not central, but make it easier to go to central. Hello. Hello. We're taking the ferry across to the Kowloon side. Hong Hong. Why are we going there? So we can walk along the waterfront while the sun sets in our face. Guys, the view is beautiful. Look at that color. Which we like never go to. Um, right there, my dear, right there. Which we never go to because we find it too expensive. So Arthur and I got some gift certificates from one of his friends. Um, so because we have the gift certificates, we decided to finally come here and try out some of their new cakes and coffee. That's so cheap. <laughs> We're so motherfucking cheap. <laughs> I'm term frugal. Frugal, there we go. We're very frugal. Yeah, I don't think any... World meet the most frugal dentist. <laughs> With some right... This is expensive. We're never going to ever again. Yeah, because we have no coupons, all right? I'm sure we're wasting away. So Arthur dropped some of the cake on the floor, waiting. Waiting for you to eat. You gave me like three seconds, Arthur. Not bad. Is it worth $48? Yes, because we didn't pay it. If you had to pay for it, Arthur, would you pay for it? No. This is a man who will buy a 400 Hong Kong dollar cake, a cheesecake, a $400 cheesecake from one of these artisanal bakeries, have five bites, and then throw away the rest. No, I buy for my nurses, or like my friends, or my family. I'm a very cheap person. And me. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the site 
It's so gorgeous. Honestly, Arthur, we should use your camera to film more. Look at the quality of this. So much nicer. Oh wow, oh my gosh, that was so weird. The, the lighting like did a weird thing and it looks like the world was exploding. Oh, it's doing it again. Let's see if I can try that again. Oh, it's not working anymore. Today we're having a hot pot. Are you filming me? Yeah. Oh. Today we're having hot pot with Sandy on her balcony. Look at this beautiful flower. You see this beautiful flower? It's a very blurry flower. It's like me. It's a beautiful flower. <laughs> You're so silly about that. The quality isn't that great to me. The camera. The camera oh. quality isn't that great. Oh my gosh. I so said that is so rude. The camera quality is not that great. It's so blurry. Is it because it's dark? Or I thought I thought it would be like okay even if it's dark. Or maybe you're just really shit at recording. No. Sandy, should I open the bottle? I'm going to Are you going to film me opening this right there? Ready? It's not like a hot pot with a bottle of champagne. Or bubble, as we say, because this isn't champagne. Are you even filming me? Yes. Please don't like pop it. Huh? Arthur was a bartender, so he always tells me how good he is at doing things like this, but we all know that he was a shit bartender. If it was me, I wouldn't have made sound. What a lot of bull crap. I was gonna really bet? quiet. Are you serious right now? You think that okay. was quiet? Guys, the next time Arthur opens a bottle, Ask we're gonna Ask Sandy for another one right now. It will be... I cannot wait for him to fuck it up. I will not fuck it up. Oh, you will, Arthur, because I've seen you open bottles with champagne. I will not fuck... Sandy, do you have another bottle? We have to finish this bottle first, you idiot. Rumble, rumble. Open it, open it, open it. Oh, it smells quite nice. I wonder what soup base it is. Wow. Everybody remember that time that Arthur said that he can open the bottle without making a noise? I want to see it. Thank you, Oh, that was pretty good.